Mr. Olawale V. Makinde buries father and mother in a unique way. City on the 8th and 9th of April 2022, when the remains of the parents of the managing director of Goshen Trust Homes Limited, Mr. Akin Waliodu on Makinde and Mrs. Eunice on Makinde, was laid to rest. Jerusalem, Tonu, Orimilumi, the bodies left the Messi Specialist Hospital Mug and a convoy led by Climax Funeral Undertaker to their residence before being taken to a market event center where the wake keep took place in a carnival like way led by CSC Church of God Yaba Idonri. <laughs> I 
A burial service took place at Tomakinde Event Center where a tourist like graveyard was designed for the burial before proceeding to the church for Thanksgiving service. I 
A laughing Anglican grammar school playing field wore a new look as guests were received in a special way inside a marquee air-conditioned tent. Guests were entertained by evangelist Yinka Ayefele, the popular gospel singer, and the hip-hop star artist Two-Face Idibia.
Many dignitaries made it to the occasion. Amongst them were Honorable Minister for Niger Delta, Chief Tayo Alashwadura, Distinguished Senator Ayo Akinya Lure, FCA, Senator representing Undo Central Senatorial District, Engineer Benson Aji Shegiri, former Director General of Federal Ministry of Water Resources, Abuja. In this, oh, wait, no. <laughs> ah, there was a business item. You know, for somebody to live in the village, 
a multi-millionaire in business. It shows that God actually was a blessed you. So God really, really blessed you. Everything that he put his hand for was a success. And to God be the glory for that land. And he did not just come there. He raised good children also. Uh, Baba also had many wives. You know, Baba had eight wives. And uh, to the glory of God, all the times of children came through him. And all the children are all doing well. They are good. And one of them is a Wale Mandele. That is a business icon in the uh, and uh, we have many of them here, and they are going to have brought us here. Uh, also, for the mother that just passed off, uh, the death is painful, but God Almighty is the one that can make life and also take life. So, I believe it's God that must have called us to her. But also, if you look at it, he must have loved the husband so much that he couldn't allow the husband to go far that had to follow him. So I see her as the one that loved the father the most among all the wives, the eight wives that we had. That is why she chose to follow him. And uh, why he, she was here also, she was a mother's wife. He was one of her, you go to their, to their house now, the other wives have refused to come out. If she wasn't a good woman, they would not want to feed. They would always have to be a that. So the male father that her colleagues Wives and we see her means that she was a good woman. She was a good woman to have raised all fairy children, you know, like Wale, Mandela, and uh, Makile. It shows that she was a good woman. And we pray that Almighty God will come from front of the children she left behind and we grant her eternal rest. So we are here to celebrate their lives and believe that God Almighty will make things better for the children of the different Dr. Kola Ademujimi, former chief of staff on those states, Mr. and Mrs. Omogbemi Olowo Kondi, MD CEO of Omer's Commodity Resources Limited, Dickin Honorable Mayoko Akimoladun, MD CEO of Platinum Television. Uh, time for everything, the time to be born and the time to die. This two time has come into the life of uh, Mr. and Mrs. Omogbemi buried father and mother at the same time. We were buried husband and wife today. And uh, it's a unity. Uh, one has to look at it that it's a good couple, you know, that we're buried today. And the celebrant of today, who is um, Mr. and Mrs. Wale uh, Makede, they, they have been able to prove that they have a good parent, and they've been able to show that uh, they are celebrating the parents. It is a prayer that you know, the death of this young parent will not be a source of this, you know, sorrow in their life in the mansion of Jesus. That the legacy at which the parents have left, they should be able to go along with it. Because the man is known in his lifetime to be a very gentle, peaceful, and loving human being. The man that is uh, known, the man that we, you know, people grew up to know as a rich man, and he died as a rich man. So the children should be able to leave his legacy, legacy of uh, good conduct, legacy of uh, peaceful life, and uh, legacy of uh, you know giving. It's a man that gives to people who are. That's my wish for the Doctor Adelaide Jasper. Olusayero, Donri, Federal Federal Constituency, PDP, MHR aspirants and hopeful. Honorable Mrs. Ronke Akin Dolire, Mrs. Ronke Akin Kuo, Honorable Gidi Olatubosu Adegbe Yeni, MD CEO Ogidi Block Industry, member of the MFM Church of God, members of Idori Descendants Union Abuja, members of Zikov Club Idori, members of Classical Ladies, staff of Goshen Trust Group of Companies, among others. <laughs> Mr. Ola Wale Makinde and the siblings, Mr. Ola Lege Omakinde, Mr. Bola Omakinde, popularly called Bola of France, danced to the lyrics of Yinka Ayefele and Two Face Idibius. <laughs> I 
Africa too. My Africa too. We are my Africa too. My Africa too. Mr. Lawale Makinde appreciated all the guests and thanked God for the good gestures of the legacy his parents laid down for the children. Adelanke Akimoladon reporting for Platinum Television. Mm -hmm.